More at noon. Well, the city of Chicago has struck a deal with a private company to take over the city's parking meters. This agreement will help plug the city's budget gap, but it could also mean you will pay higher meter rates. WGN's Jillian Cruz, live from City Hall now with more. Hi, Jillian. Hello, Steve. The city budget director says it's been 70 years in many Chicago neighborhoods since parking meter rates went up. So if city council approves this lease beginning next year, when you go to feed that meter, you can definitely expect to pay more. I would tell you that the $3 rates will go to $3.50 next year. The dollar rates will go to $2. And those that are less than a dollar will go to $1. These are hourly rates. The city says the deal calls for gradual rate increases over five years. The proposed 75-year lease has to be approved by council. It calls for nearly a $2 billion payout to Chicago, uh, making the city the first major metropolitan area to lease out its parking meters. Uh, the winning bidders, Chicago Parking Meters LLC, will be charged with modernizing meters for both cash and electronic credit card payments. The mayor says the vast majority of parking meters are downtown, so this shouldn't severely impact residents in outlying neighborhoods, the theory goes. Now, most importantly, the mayor argues that the lump sum payment will help the city balance future budgets and survive the lingering recession. We are also proposing creating a second account of $325 million to help balance our budget through 20, 2012. And that is very, very important to have. Otherwise, you cannot ever balance these budgets. The mayor wants to take another chunk of the payout to establish what he calls a rainy day fund. $324 million would be put aside to help stabilize future budgets until the national and global economies start to improve. The mayor clearly worried about the economic crisis. He hopes that this will help avert future problems along with other high-profile leases of public property. You have the Midway Airport lease and, of course, the Chicago Skyway lease. Now, the mayor says it would be fiscally irresponsible for him to cancel hundreds of layoffs that are already in the works, a city budget that has already been approved for 2009. It's a $150 million shortfall uh, that the city is looking at, but the mayor making no indication that he plans to uh, halt the pending layoffs that are about to hit City Hall. Reporting live outside City Council Chambers, Julian Cruz, WGN News. Thanks, Julian. We want to hear from you. Do you think the city's uh, deal to lease parking meters is a good idea? Text yes or no to 97999, or you can vote online at WGNTV.com. We'll have the results just before the midday lottery drawing at 1240.